I'm you. Slow. Come with me. Ooh. I'm gonna go into the secret chamber with Jon Snow. <laughs> Hello, bitches of Earth, and welcome back to Game of Thrones. <laughs> I know I haven't played this game in so long, but I totally remembered it, and I was like, you know, I want to finish it. I know nobody is talking about Game of Thrones anymore, but apparently I'm stuck in 2019, okay? Remember back when the worst thing that happened in the year was the ending of Game of Thrones? What happened, man? Anyways, me personally, I like how Game of Thrones ended, so don't at me, okay? I know it's been really long, and it's been really long for me, so I'm gonna go ahead and give y'all a little bit of a recap, so you can understand what's going on before we begin episode 2. So, recap! So, this guy is a squire who does squire things for this guy. Lord of Trees or something. A uh, little plant dies, his squire goes on a squire adventure to avenge his death or some shit. He comes across the Bolton, and they both like, this is my land, and he's like, nah bro, this is my land, and then he's like, you suck, and then they tickle each other's swords for a bit. Some more deaths happen, and he's like, my lord wouldn't know about this, and Gerald is like, yeah, well, tell him he smelt of elderberries, too. Then his father dies, his sister dies. This is Game of Thrones, who doesn't die? Gerald ends up in House Forester, and the Lady of Weeds is like, You out of control! You spilled the tea, and now we all gonna die! So she takes the sword and says, Off to the wall! So Gerald leaves and is like, See ya, wouldn't wanna be ya! So now, since the Lord of Forests is dead, there has to be a new lord, but since the second oldest is off in La La Land, so this young guy is next to, is next to be lord, and he's like, shit, how can I be lord when my balls haven't even dropped yet? Then, Lord Whitehill comes up, and he be like, I hear someone be talking shit! And the new lord is like, oh, we talking so much shit! So then the mama bear comes in, and she's like, get out! You heard her? Then my hero is like, I'm calling the Bolton. Then Mama is like, oh, we in deep shit. I got to tweet at your sister in King's Landing because she got Margaret on her side. So Margaret comes in and she's like, so she is suspicious of all this suspiciousness. So bend the knee to her because I'm trying to get the King D. So, so she is like, I don't like you North people. And incest is wincest. And he drinks and knows things. So, she pulls Margaret aside, and she's like, Can you help my family and tell the Bolton to, like, fuck off? Then Margaret is like, Fine, but first, I gotta go show the king my boobies. But then in the end, Margaret backed out like a little bit, because she just wanna be queen. She's all like, It's all about me, me, me. Then Mara's like, Shit, I gotta tweet at my family that they're all gonna die. Back in the woodland, little lord is doing lordy things, like picking a new hand or some shit, and they over there are like, what? Diplomacy! What? And Mama is like, you are fired. I'm gonna get your brother who's off in exile in Utopia. And Ramsey comes in like, it's war! And then stabs him in the neck. And that's what I remember so far. <laughs> if you want to go in more, into more details, just watch the last videos. It's a, it's a lot. I mean, it's Game of Thrones. I mean... But, uh, I really miss Game of Thrones. I wish it would come back. But, uh, I know everybody else has a different opinion on that. But, uh, let's go ahead and begin! I'm excited. Previously. Oh, they're gonna give you a recap. Probably better than mine. These are dark days, I fear. To the wall. The boy's done nothing wrong. The future of this house is in Lord Ethan's hands now. Duncan, I've 
decided to name you as my sentinel. Oh yeah, I picked him. Yeah, okay. I'm just worried about my family. The king was not inclined to offer help for your family. Are you willing to risk an alliance with the crown? I'm sorry, Lord Tyrion, but it's a risk I cannot afford. Your mother asked me to cross the narrow sea to find your brother, Rashi. We don't want White Hill men within these walls. Oh man, who racist? You can be my highborn ward. Oh hell. Uh, oh. Ethan. Uh, uh, no! Don't let them take me! Oh, he just took the little boy. Well, that was a better recap. I got him killed, by the way. I don't know if there was a choice I could make that would not get him killed. But I have a feeling he was probably going to die. Oh, shit! Is this what I think it is? Uh-oh. Watch out! Danny! Danny, watch out! Oh, that's the brother. What did he do? Just give it a stare down? But don't fuck with me. Even the scorpions don't want to fuck with him. Whoa, it's just me, Beska. <sighs> Took you long enough. The rail's getting warm. Or warmer, I should say. I don't really you can stop how to pacing. Play this. They'll be here soon. I don't pace them. I'm looking at spill. Is that wine? Or blood? Taste it. <laughs> Taste it and find out. <laughs> I know. I know Game of Thrones. <laughs> this stuff is weak compared to Northern Ale. Well, then go back to the north. This place could use a good cleaning. I complain to the owner. Except he's probably dead. It's a skylight. Look at the sun. This place probably used to be nice. Nice having the place to ourselves, though. Is that my girlfriend? Can I take this? Oh, I can. I might. Can I grab it? I'm gonna grab it. This is mine now. That's my. I'm a Viking. Look at, look at the damage wall. Looks like we weren't the first to rough up the place. Okay. Hooker, hooker. Ooh, let's get, let's smoke some hooker, Besky. Fragrant. Becky, what's her name? Becky. All right, I guess that's it. What do you want? Look at. I know, I know. Woman sellsword. Four years fighting by your side, and you still can't get over it. Come on, Asha, quit staring. Let's get drinking. Oh, I like her. Ale. It goes in yellow, comes out yellow. Waste time even drinking it, if you ask me. <laughs> Considering we found it in an abandoned tavern, it's not bad. They smell off to you. It's the only thing oh, in the Yungfair that doesn't. I know. It's a filthy haven for thieves, murderers, and other deadly bastards. You should feel right at home. Oh. I know I do. May we drink, thieve, and fight I'll until the end. That. I'll drink to that. <laughs> You'll drink to anything. Okay. That's what being off in La La Land is about. The land of freedom! So... <laughs> you wanna get laid? Have you oh. forgotten <laughs> about our honored and exalted guest? Go see if he's still breathing. Ooh. They're into freaky stuff. How's he doing? <laughs> we need him alive to collect his bounty. After that... Check him. He looks, he looks fine. Fat and scared. <laughs> Good. Let him stay that way. Until we collect our gold, at least. Oh, the, I thought they were going to eat him. Like, ooh, he's fat. Let's, we're a bunch of... Eight hundred gold dragons for capturing him. Lucky we caught him trying to flee Yunkai. Lucky for us. Not so lucky for him. 
We should find more former slave masters with bounties on their heads. I don't need any more naked fat men in my life, thank you. Oh. <laughs> they say only the poor know how to really spend money. We'll buy the finest wines, the best whores. Oh, she a bed lesbian? Out, please. Sounds nice, doesn't it? I don't need whores. Oh man, I missed it. We'll live like lords, princes, kings. My point is, with enough coin, we could do anything. I'm too slow. Go anywhere. I could afford passage back to Westeros. Why do you want to go back? To Ironrath. I've heard nothing from my family in years. You mean go home? They treated <coughs> you like shit there. They, mm -hmm. Kicked you out because you fell in love with a girl from the wrong damn house. Gwyn. A man doesn't choose who he loves. Your family should understand that. Westeros and its bloody houses. Who fucking cares? Uh, it's not that simple. It's not that simple. In the north, these feuds run deep. Oh, fuck the north. We have a good thing here. Fuck and the any north. Moment fuck now, a we're gonna be rich. <laughs> Let's make a toast. To all of us deadly bastards. To get in it. To 800 gold dragons in our pocket. Well said. Cheers. Why are we drinking in these little teeny teapots? Like, what Whiskey. the fuck? We'll drink up. Freed slaves put the bounty on Bizarre. They did. With his own gold. So why are the fucking Lost Legion here? Ooh, the spice. Is that Tazal? From the Volantis job. Maybe he's forgotten about that. You! I told you if I saw you again. Tazal! Isn't it funny how life brings old friends together? I'd cut your fucking throats! Good to see you it's too. good to see you too, to sell. Where is he? Where's who? The fat guy? Here. 400 dragons. They must be working for the wise masters. 400 dragons? And that's all you're getting. Us. The bounty is 800. You get four. It's more than you deserve. Excuse me? Give us 800 and you can have him. Don't be an asshole now. We're all sell swords here. We are nothing like you. The Lost Legion are the blood of all Valyria. And we are done taking orders from whimpering pigs. Ah! Uh, Bloody hell! That was 800 to kill him. And we're done with you too. La da diri sonpasi. You just made a huge mistake, Tazel. You two are going to be useful to me for once. Not bloody likely. The wise masters will hear how Asher Forrester kidnapped the venerable Bezak. How he wouldn't take less than 800 gold dragons. So he killed Bezak instead. Me? Luckily, we were there to wow, deliver you see swift how they twist justice. My so you steal the money and we get the blame. Ponte Osinas! Fuck you! Ah! Eight hundred. All right. <laughs> Who dies first? Who wants to die on the end of my sword? Kill them now! Oh! Good shot. No one more life. Here's one. Stop! Oh! 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 She couldn't pass me. Oh, <laughs> whoopsie! I didn't hit the button on time. Vale Mogulis. I don't know if I said that right. I've never been able to pronounce that right. She couldn't pass me. To be the one. You owe me one. Where'd you come from? Ooh. 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 Ooh.
work. That was badass. This is for Volantis. Pesca. Fuck you, Asher. Fuck you. Fuck me. Ooh, you don't need that hand. Cost of Achilles. Achilles. Irribonius. Oh. Oh. How many guys were in this house? You know what this reminds me of? <laughs> that brothel in Novos. Damn, the brothels in Novos are wild. <laughs> But you you kill me. But the Lost me. Legion won't stop. Oh, that was me. Ooh, I'm brutal. Oh man. To Saul. <laughs> kill them you both. You so disappointed. Like how dare you? Asha. <laughs> 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 Wait, who's that? Oh, shit! That's my uncle, I think. Fucking all the gods of fire and fuck! <laughs> what are the gods of fire? Who the fuck is he? My uncle. I remember, so? I remember. Fuck. Fuck. More on their way. We need to go. Take the money. Take the money. Oh. Yes. Come on. I'm gonna carry that big ass thing around. Don't y'all have wallet? Damn. Oh fuck. We have to keep moving. Malcolm, stop. Asher, I'm glad I found you, my boy. It's been far too long. Ah uh, yeah. What are you doing here? A family Your reunion. Your brother Ethan sent me. I'm here to bring you He's home. Dead, by the way. Who wants to go to Red? Oh. Man, I missed that. I missed sitting down and having this and watching it. Damn. The time. 2019. We took a <laughs> Wait, who's that now? Um, excuse you. <gasps> oh, he's still alive. Kind of. Hey. Help. Send help. Damn foresters. Earth is so fucking far away. Brother did, and your mama did. I don't know. His mom, I don't think his mama did. <laughs> That's far enough. I come from the twins bearing the dead of House Forrester. Lordly types from the looks of them. All right, we'll take them. Well, they're not free, are they? How much are you paying for them? Sir Royland. You again. <laughs> Have you got this time? Some poor peasant right. dressed up like a I, lord, uh, a stable boy was, in Bannerman's clothes, uses this at dusk and day, and you have the fucking soul to get out of here. This house has suffered the loss of many good men. And you know, they're going to kill you, they're going to kill you. Therefore, leave. Now, fine. I'll dump them in the river then. Uh oh, oh. You come back here again, you won't be leaving. You got that? I, I heard you. That was a sheep fucker. Go, 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 go! You only have to survive, bro! Don't worry yourself. What is it, sir? This one's still alive! You 
you there? Who are you? It's me. Roderick. Oh. Roderick? Roderick! By oh, the gods, it is you! Sir? Fetch the maester! Hurry! Fetch He's the maester! He's got the maggot! Roderick! By the Lord of Light, he shall be lies, risen. I don't know. What are you doing? You just pulling them out of my butt? What's he doing? He's cutting off my leg. Excuse me. What kind of doctor are you? <laughs> my lord, you should not be awake. Uh -oh. The milk of the poppy. Drink. Come now. Okay, I'll drink it. I don't know what, what you're doing, but... That's it. He looks like he's in a lot of pain. Roderick! My lady! <laughs> I am at a very delicate moment in the surgery. Please, I want to see my son. Uh, let him How finish. is he? Will he live? Let him... <gasps> Sir, my lady, I must insist that you leave. <laughs> Roderick, what have they done to you? These wounds would have killed any other man. <coughs> As it is, you may never walk again. Oh? Yeah, because you took my leg, Doc. Why? Why? Roderick? What's wrong my with you? My leg! He drank the milk of the poppy. Please don't leave me. Not yet. Oh. Still in hell. is a long time. We've been at war How for bad is it? <laughs> Maester Tengren says your leg may never fully heal. How bad is it? It's non-existent. Wait, did he cut off my leg? I didn't see it. And your face. I felt worse. I thought Kaf was bad I've been as better. <laughs> well, at least you look better than you did. What a Roderick, there's something you need to know. Ethan is dead. Oh. Ethan. Bruce Bolton's bastard came here and threatened to take me away. Ethan grabbed me. And that monster put a blade through his throat. How you fault, bit? Like it was nothing. Ethan. She what was happened to him? Ooh. We'll make Ramsay pay for what he did. I promise. Good. Yeah, yeah, we will. We're planning to honor Ethan in the grove alongside father. And now mother wants me to write this song for the funeral. I can't. <laughs> you can, Dahlia. <laughs> I'll make Ramsey pay. It's been chaos. When he can't the even White get White Hill walked. soldiers stationed in our courtyard. Even the small folk don't feel safe. You need to show everyone who this house belongs to. They need a lot. You're still a hero to them. <clears throat> if you lead, others will follow. I know you still need time to heal, but I'll be fine, Talia. Council's meeting in the Great Hall right now, actually. Nobody expects you there, but if you think you're ready. 
I'm gonna be there. I'm gonna hop on my way there. Can you even stand? They could use your leadership. Uh, let's find out. Only one way to find out. <clears throat> I missed you, brother. <clears throat> Oh, I have both legs. You can do this, Roderick. <laughs> I thought the doctor cut it can. off. <laughs> come on, come on, come on, come on. Fucking help! She's just standing at me, staring at me. I'm fine. Y'all got a cane, like a walker. Why'd you do that? I won't let anyone see you like this. Not when the house appears so weak already. I was rolled in on a corpse cart. The damage is done. But you're the lord of the house now. <coughs> you must appear strong, solid. You can't do that on the floor. What? Excuse me. It's a long I'm way to sorry. the great hall. We can't risk you falling where others can see. Take my hand. Let me help you. No. I have to do this on my own. All right. She's over there like, get up, it's just a scratch. <laughs> you can do it, you can do it, you don't need no woman's help. Go back to the kitchen. <laughs> now the hard part. Get me a better cane, bit if you want to help. You're really doing it. Everyone will be so glad to see you up, though I think you'll find that much has changed. Oh, we're about to see Dan Snow. There's Gerald. Oh, oh. <laughs> his name is Jared. Um, look at the wall. Always wanted to see it, but not like this. Castle Black. So this is the seat of the Night's Watch. He's like wearing a sweater in this weather. Like, aren't you cold, bro? John Snow, John Snow. Recruit at the gate. You know nothing. <sighs> Look at that horse. It looks like spirit. This is my horse spirit, everybody. Where's John Snow? I don't, that's all I care about. I don't care about none of y'all. Hey, right, do y'all know it? that John Snow fucks his hair? <laughs> Another one for fro- <laughs> On a horse, no less. Now you stay there, spirit. Oh, you just smack my ass. That was John Snow. Looks like it was built by giants, doesn't it? You're new, here to take the black. Because mm. you got that look about you. Aye, I am. Thought so. I'm new here myself. Oh, you're going to be my friend. Frostfinger. He's the one you want. Handles all new recruits. <laughs> Which one's Frostfinger? That grizzled old prune over there. There's us new recruits. 
are all dead men. But don't let well, him scare nice. you. <laughs> that's just his way. You seem nice. That's not so good round here. Well, I'm sorry. You want me to dab you in the throat? You fight like a girl. A wildling girl, maybe. Excuse me? <laughs> I say that as if I'm personally offended. <laughs> I'm a wildling. If I existed in Game of Thrones, I would be a wildling. <clears throat> you recruits. You come, you train, you fight, you die. What? Who are you, boy? You're so positive. Um, I was a squire. I served Lord Forrester of Ironrath. Mm -hmm. A squire from Ironrath. And how does a squire get himself sent to the wall? A thief. A raper. You abandon your post? Uh, or do you just fancy dying someplace I'm a volunteer. cold? Actually, I'd like to volunteer. Hmm. You just want to serve the realm, is that it? Well, I made yes, a mistake. Sir. You arrive on horseback, wearing a soldier's livery. You're a bad liar, Garrett Tuttle. Oh, he sees right through me. How do you know my name? From Duncan Tuttle, Castellan of House Forester. My uncle wrote to the Night's Watch. He goes on for a bit, but then he asks us to make you a ranger. Oh, he gonna make me a cook. As if it's a knighthood. Oh, no. So you see, Tuttle, I know all about you. You lied to me the first chance you got. <laughs> You'll fit in well here. Ooh, I'm sorry. If you say so. If you say so. I do. Oh, I didn't have an now attitude. Uh -oh. I'll start your training in the morning. <laughs> For today, you need a cot and a cloak. Understood. And you need a new attitude. <laughs> I'm sorry. Stop it. Oh, and Tuttle. Sooner or later, the night's watch will, when it comes, try to make so it So welcoming. I'm sorry this game is like a little glitchy. It's an old game and apparently they took it off the market because it was bad. But here I am playing it. Last we'd heard, Asher was in Slaver's Bay. So Malcolm caught a ship headed for... La La Land. I heard they took him off a corpse cart. <laughs> and he's missing his arms and legs. You know what they call me? Zombies. At least he can still eat and shit. The White Hill soldiers are drunk again. Words. And we have too few men to handle them. Let's just get to the Great Hall. He's over there like, well, I'm a snack of beer too! dead. <laughs> and they've dressed up some peasant in his place. Fill me up, would you? And bring us some salted pork while you're at it. <laughs> Fill yourself up, you lazy fuck. For real? Line's almost done, actually. Is that him? Yes, yeah, but has to be, doesn't it? Don't you recognize? Don't you recognize? These our brother? <laughs> Had a run-in with Walder Frey, did you? Oh my God! Should have buried him with the corpses. Can I kill him? Forest is Real cursed. shame about your leg, oh, Lord. Gives it a toss. Well, At just... least I'm up and walking, but you probably be over there in bed crying. Who are you? We have business in the Great Hall. <laughs> oh, am I gonna die now? Go round. You don't want to test me. Is that right? Oh, I'm gonna die. I'm because gonna die! pretty sad to me. Kill him! I wonder what's weaker. Your legs? Or this house? How about my fist in your face? 
I am the lord of this house. And you will move. Step aside. Go on then, my lord. If you play any trick. Four years. It's been eighty-four years for him to get up their damn stairs. It's ridiculous. You're treating them like the guests. wine keeps their wits dull. It makes us look weak. Both of you, please. So you'd rather they riot? Duncan, you're a damn fool. Sometimes it doesn't matter what you think. I was chosen as sentinel, my lords. <laughs> That's right. I came back from the dead. I'm the Lord of Light. Roderick, my boy. Come join us. Lady Talia, you should have told us the Lord needed help. Do I look like I need help? <gasps> my Lord. It's good. <clears throat> it's good to see you awake, Lord Roderick. We didn't expect you so soon. The Maester said it would be weeks before you were walking, if you walked again at all. It was highly probable. I told you he'd be up and Let's about, get not here to, to talk about my elf. Perhaps we should get started. Yes, let's. We're gonna go. Stanley's to told me the state of our house. Then you know our situation is grim, my lord. No thanks to your sentinel. He's been getting the White Hill soldiers drunk. It keeps them off their guard. They think you're a bloody fool. My lord, please. Oh, oh, I'm a fool. Oh, here we go. At least I was there by Ethan's side when Ramsay stole. I've told you. I was keeping an eye on the Bolton soldiers. You should have been protecting your lord. Now Ethan's dead, and Ryan a Let hostage. Let me Woo. I am your lord. Of course. Apologies, my lord. The White Hills Officer. are my brother. We fight amongst ourselves when we should be fighting them. We need an army to win that fight. Well, go get one! If we don't have one. Not anymore. Then find me one, Sir Royal. That's I'm no simple command, my lord. Last time I Most was of our men fled after Lord Ethan was killed. And our allies are either dead or too afraid of the Boltons to help us. You forget the Glenmores. You'd be wed to Elena Glenmore already, if not for the war. And her father is no coward. Now that you've returned, the marriage can proceed as planned. Oh, yeah. The okay. marriage? Married. Well, not much has changed. War. The Glenmores may no longer desire the union. Lady Elena will decide for herself. Your betrothed is on her way here as we speak. Lady Elena? She's coming now. I'm not ready. My son, I understand your doubts, but you gotta if she still wishes to marry, we'd have the allies we so desperately need. And got Their a booty. army would become oath-bound to Roderick. And we could burn High Point to the fucking ground. Yes, this marriage could be our chance. Of course, we must hope Lady Elena still wants to marry Roderick. Talking about a marriage, not an Ironwood contract. I'll secure a father's army, no matter what it takes. Very good, my lord. Just be careful not to push Elena too hard. I'm gonna end if up Elena does come to Ironrath, she'll see those soldiers in the courtyard. We starve them out, and they'll have to leave. I'd rather they be lying around drunk than setting the stables on fire. My lord, perhaps you could put an end to this tiresome dispute? Uh, I don't know. Just hand her. I don't know what the best... We could Get keep drunk? them fed, but take away their wine. Well, that'd be something at least. Good. Now, if there's nothing more to discuss. Maester, it's time to light the ironwood torches. 
Yes, my lady. Time for war! Dun, 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 dun. Welcome back, my lord. It's got to be back. <laughs> Look at those candles in the back, man. They're all like fucked Gregor up. Gregor last lit these torches when his mother passed. Ironwood doesn't burn easily, he told me. But foresters have a way. And now we light them for him. And Ethan. How is your song coming? Ethan always helped me with music. It's not the same without him. You're a fine musician, Talia. You'll do a great job. Oh. Everyone knows how much Ethan meant to you. I'm sure it will honor him well. They're gonna make me sing at his funeral. About Elena, I've sent a letter to Mira. The Tyrells hold much influence over the Glenmores. I don't know where things stand between her and Lady Marjorie, but maybe your sister can find a way to help. Sister! Don't fuck this up now! It's entirely ridiculous. If it's not the flowers, it's the food or the table settings. I am going to war with my family and all you care about. Is that the letter to the orphanage? Yes, my lady. It's nearly done. Like Make it. sure to tell them we'll send all the leftovers. Oh, that's nice. And give them the scraps. something nice after that. We will make a sizable donation in the name of King Joffrey. A little presumptuous of you, Mira, but I like it. They'll be very grateful. We gotta make them love us so we can, like, control them. <laughs> and the seal. Here you are. Oh, are there any more invitations to send, or are we finally done with the cursed things? One more. An invitation to Sir Maynard. Ah, yes. One of my That's all the people you're inviting to the king's companions. wedding? That little fucking stack? <laughs> they are not many people like the king. <laughs> I have a letter for Lady Mira Forrester. Thank you. My pleasure, Lady Mira. Snake! Snake! What is it, Mira? None it's from my snake. mother. She asks that I help ensure Roderick's betrothal to Elena Glenmore remain intact. How can you do that from a thousand leagues away? I still don't care about nothing. Ah, it's my help she's after, isn't it? She's a bold woman. Most would shy away from asking such things. Forgive my mother. She doesn't see the harm in what she does. She's not entirely wrong. A letter from me could encourage the Glenmores to honor the betrothal. You know, help us but it wouldn't be very discreet. You'd be forcing their hand. That isn't the way I do things. You pushed me before and you saw the results. Damn it. You don't care about me. I'm sure your brother can secure the marriage on his own. My girl. I'd better get going. Mira, we'll talk more later. All she cares about is sucking the king's dick. That's all you care about. I'm gonna go back. Can she go back? <clears throat> Do something crazy. Flip the table over. If Lady Marjorie wrote a letter. Ooh. Oh, I'm about to do something bad. Dear Lady Elena. No. Dearest Lady Elena. Oh, I'm about to get myself killed. How exciting! <laughs> she took the seal with her. Hopefully a signature will do. So what are you going to put on it? Mira, 
Lady Marjorie sent me to pick up the letters. Elena of House Glenmore. I've never heard of the Glenmores. I know you're very busy with Lady Marjorie and... and all that's happening with your family. But I was hoping we could talk. <clears throat> I'm about to get Margaret killed. If you don't mind. Go ahead then. Well, it's... We really should get these letters sent first. Do you need any help with them? I've got them. Where to be this is about it? I've got him! Smoke. I want him to be my trainer. <laughs> Oi, fuckhead. <laughs> Oi. You might be new here, but you're in my spot. It's a lie. So move. I'm not moving. Ooh. Wrong fucking answer. Most of you will be dead within the year. <sighs> Frostfinger in his bloody speech. If you want to survive in the Night's Watch, listen I said it'd be all tough guy. You I'm know why I got to sent die. to the wall? The wall was erected over 8,000 years why? ago. Why? To defend the realm from At this girl I used to fuck like now and again. And Face like a queen, tits like a whore. It turned out she was married to some lordly. He tried to stick me tall, with this. Stretches for over 300 miles from the frost fangs in the west. I was stuck in him instead. So next time I say move, you best fucking move. You best sure, for once, dick. will you? What's your problem? I'm sick of Finn bragging about all the girls he's fucked. <laughs> and what dire crime are you here for? <laughs> fucking potatoes. <laughs> potatoes? You fuck potatoes? You fuck potatoes. <laughs> no, I stole them. That's what got me sent to the war. Nobody cares, thief. Potato Don't fucker. call me that. My name's Cotter. Cotter the potato fucker. <laughs> There's one for the songs. Oi, my sister was hungry. I've got something for your sister. Uh, Don't fucking talk about my sister, all right? Leave him be. Who in seven hells is talking back? Potato fucker. Total. Who was it? These two were arguing. Ooh, oh, I'm a Not wise to point the finger at your new brothers, Tuttle. Everything Garrett, I do is Tuttle wrong. Tuttle here wants to be a ranger. So we can go north of the wall and die on some wildling spear. But what he wants doesn't mean shit. So today you're all gonna show me what you're made of. Can you swing a sword? Shoot a bow. Are you strong? Those who do strong well like my might mother. just survive. The rest of you. Frostfinger. <gasps> it might be your bird. Need a word. Go on, get started. I'm gonna go kiss his ass so he can be my friend. Best of luck, Tuttle. Ooh, I'm gonna kick his ass. Here we go. Again. Bows up. See those dummies? Those are fens. Come to eat your, bra your brains for breakfast. <laughs> Dance knows just like. <laughs> He's a robot! <sighs> Castle Black. Yep, so that's. This is home now. Yep. Snow. Let me be your friend. Jump no way. Wait, jump snow. Let me be your friend. God damn it. <laughs> Do I talk? 
to him? Tuttle, I gave you orders. So what are you doing up here? Sorry, sir. I'll get back to work. I was just trying to be friends with Jams. No! That's the door to the mess hall. Ooh, how observant. Wish they'd serve up more than stew. Good bitch. Be grateful. Uh, I'm just gonna... Wait, is Jon Snow up here? Jon Snow? Yeah, you're not Jon Snow. The place is falling apart. Maybe they need more builders. Like you? Where's Jon Snow? Was that Jon Snow? They're not bad, they make you like chase after him. Try to lift some of the bells. You there, recruit. Scrawny, aren't you? See if you can carry one of these barrels over to the winch. <coughs> What's in it? It's pitch. Dump it off the wall and it'll burn the wildlings down to their fucking bones. Right. I can do this. Yeah, yeah, you can. Left, 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 left. Use your muscles, Squire. Want some help? Aw, <laughs> oh, man, I wish I was a tough guy. I talk so much shit for somebody who don't have the muscles. Come on, go, 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 go. <laughs> It's gonna take a minute. Not quite. Well, that was not very nice. Don't hurt yourself, Tuttle. Oh, I'm embarrassed. I'm thinking steward for you. You can help Frostfinger wash his cock. If the thing isn't frozen off. I'll be your ranger. I'm I'll a manifest ranger. that shit. Just you watch. Not holding my breath, brother. Why do these men gotta look so mean? They're all so mean. Uh, gotta be faster. Use. You're doing that all wrong. Well, we don't have these where I. Ah! Ooh! Dude, congratulations! You just played yourself. Man's Raider will shit himself when he sees you coming. <laughs> Let me show you. All right. Let's see if you can aim worth a wildling's ass. Uh, Shoot the I targets I tell you to. Ooh, do I have control Let's start of this? easy. Middle dummy, center of the chest. The center of the chest, is that what you said? How do you do it? That was way off the mark. Next bolt. Left target. Head. Oh! You can follow orders at least. Right target. Chest. Right target. Chest. Good. Center. Between the eyes. Um, which one? You didn't say which one! Stop daydreaming! Missed a few, but uh, well done overall. Oh, what? Did I not make you proud? Finn thinks he's so bloody clever. 
if a real wildling got his hands on him. Ah, he's just a bully. Aye, he is. That's why I took this. Swiped it right off him. Don't tell, all right? I don't think he'd take it kindly. I won't tell anyone. I'm not going to tell anyone. Anua can He's trust my you. only friend. I'm going to get him killed. We are going to die. Oh, I want to pet the horse. Ah! He's over there. They're all like practicing for a while. And I'm over here. What's he? Because that's priorities. Uh, what's his name? Prune? Oh, what's his name? Boxfinger? Petting horses. Okay, how do I, uh... I guess I gotta go fight with some swords. So let me do that. My turn! Wait, where are you going? Take that! Take that, you horse! you bloody top! You, grab a practice sword. Why can't I get a real one? Where I, tell you. I want the black one. This one should do. Yes. I'll be sparring with you today. And I'm gonna kick Remember, your these blades are dulled, but a sword's still a sword. Good luck. I got this. Ooh. Come on, keep at it. Are they gonna just make me bad no matter what? Ooh. Ooh. Am I making Papa proud? Ooh. I'm gonna be a ranger. Well, I'm gonna be a real boy. <laughs> Get off me, you bloody ox. You got lucky. He's like, okay, I make Papa proud. You're pathetic. Fuck off. You didn't even try. A crossbow is a coward's weapon. Besides... I could hit that dummy from here with my... Where is it? Where the fuck's my knife? Ooh, ooh. If someone has it, I'll cut their Maybe fucking balls it. off. How the fuck should I know? You were the last one I showed it to. Well, you and... It was you. What? You little fucking thief. I... It weren't me. Finn, don't. Oh. What was I supposed to do? Give me I my didn't, knife. I didn't tell I him. I don't have it, I swear. Out of my way! Got it! Ooh, hoo, hoo. What the fuck? Fight, 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 fight! Go for the head! Ooh! Hey, I'm gonna no. be a ranger. Fight! Fight! Yeah, get him! There they go again. Didn't. And Kara defended it. The last thing Dance, I no. got no longer. Let me kiss your ass. It. I swear I don't have it. You must have hid it. <laughs> and you, I expected better, Tuttle. Instead, I find you doing this on your first bloody day of training. Sir, Not I... Not another word. You clearly need a few days scrubbing the latrines. Frostfinger. My favorite. I need another man to top the wall. Fine. Let him freeze his balls off. I'll deal with this one. Get off! Ooh. Mind your fucking manners. Jump slow! Jump you. slow! Come with me. Ooh. I'm gonna go into the secret chamber for Jump Snow. <laughs> Ooh. 
Is he my friend? Is he mad at me? I hope he's not mad at me. This way. I love King's Landing in the afternoon. The sun just barely kisses your skin. You used to love this place. Remember, we'd come listen to the musicians in the evening with Lady Marjorie? You're right. It's beautiful here. Don't be suspicious. Just through here. What are you doing? You'll see. Queen Cersei's finest wine. Uh, no, we shouldn't do that. You're going to get us both in trouble. Relax. Nobody will miss it, I assure you. Uh, Cersei will miss it. Trust me, she's like a little alcoholic. A little won't hurt. Nah, it's I, just wine. I ain't getting in trouble, bitch. Suit yourself then. You gonna die. You gonna die. Right. Bye. So, I uh. And me sitting well, here is an accomplice. Just... I'm not very good at this sort of thing. I'm gay. <laughs> Listen, if I tell you this, Mira, you must promise to keep it to yourself. You can tell no one. Okay. I want to trust you. I swear, I won't tell a soul. My mother was a handmaiden to Lady Elena for many years. She became pregnant. By Lady Elena? It was a disgrace to her family. <laughs> My true name is Sarah. Flowers. You're a <gasps> bastard? Ooh. Yes. I'm fortunate to be where I am. I know that. But to always have to hide. I don't want to hide from you as well. Was your mother from a noble house? She must have been. To serve Lady Elena. Yes, though it's not well known. Distant cousins of the Tyrells, I'm told. They wanted nothing to do with me after my mother died. Mm. I'm back for tea, sis. Who else knows about this? Lady Marjorie, her grandmother, and now you. It's just... I don't want to be Sarah Flowers forever. <clears throat> so you want I to marry need me? Lady Marjorie or to arrange the marriage for me. It's my chance at a life. Did you have someone in mind? Someone you'd wish to marry? I'd have to convince Lady Marjorie to make an introduction first. I know she often confides in you, and I was hoping that maybe... Sometime when she comes to you wanting to talk, you might... suggest she talk to me instead. Give me a chance to win her over. Coming from you, it's sure to mean a lot. Of course, Sarah. Thank you, Mira. Thank you. I'm so sorry. Here I am talking about myself. Rules are much greater than mine. With what happened to your brother and your father. You sure you won't have any? You look like you could use a drink. Oh, oh, oh! Hmm. A conspiracy of handmaidens. Lord Tyrion, my lord. Ladies, what have we here? If you mean to drink from that flagon, you're going about it the wrong way. We aren't doing anything wrong. On the contrary, you seem to be doing everything right. It's Not the finest arbor red. But a favorite of my sister's. Quite expensive for a handmaiden. I'd be curious to know how you got hold of it. Uh, no, you Since don't. Since I'm certain my sister didn't give it to you, she won't even share with me. Though that's hardly surprising. We. we found it in that bush. 
Lord Tyrion. Mm, he's too smart for that. Strange, it should find its way into a bush. If Cersei knew you had this wine, she'd drown you in it. Yet you're worried about an alliance with me? You need to know what risks are worth taking. Things have changed. My father has recently taken an interest in Ironwood. I want to be his ally. Did I Most fuck that up? Most of the Royal Navy went up in green flames. It must be rebuilt. He insisted I handle things myself. I'm on my way to meet representatives of Lord Whitehill. Lord Whitehill? He's hired a pair of merchant lords to broker for his house. Huh? It would seem Lord Whitehill wishes to sell the Ironwood right out from beneath your family. I don't know much about the man, but judging by his up-jumped sellswords, negotiating with him won't be pleasant. You can't let that happen. Why do you think I brought it up? Lord Tyrion, you're too smart, even for me. Like, I don't even know what you're talking about half me. the time. These men think I have no choice but to deal with them. Imagine their surprise when I bring a forester to the table. It might be the first fun I've had in months. My lady. Okay, I'll go with you. Will you save me? Will you protect me? I'm gonna be with him because he can know, he knows how to survive, so if I stay with him, I'll survive. Right? <laughs> We've been waiting here for an hour. Andros, be courteous. Courtesy in a merchant. Like finding gold in your chamber pot. Apologies, my lady. Who is this? Some girl you've brought for entertainment. Just, She's just a, a lady, Lord Andros. Just a handmaiden, my lords. What does that mean? Allow me to introduce Lady Mira of House Forrester. Mira Forrester? Why are you here? A because fair I question. We were told we would be speaking to Lord Tyrion alone. That's a private matter, my lords. Foresters have nothing to offer, my lord. If you want Ironwood, you'll have to deal with the White Hills. Andros. I'm sorry, Lady Mira, but we've already spoken to Lord You Tim. spoke, I listened. Lady Mira has since persuaded me to consider her offer first. What was my offer? <laughs> now, if you'll excuse us. You're going to dismiss You can't us? do this. I assure you, I can. This is a mistake, my lord. I don't think so. Listen to him, because I don't White know what I'm doing. Will hear of this. He's not a man to take such matters lightly. Nor Stare him I. down. <laughs> Lord Tyrion. Lord Tyrion, do let me know when you've come to a decision. I'd like the opportunity to change your mind. Lady Mira. Good day, gentlemen. Don't let the door hit you! Ah, well, that was fun. It was fun. Now, as for your offer, what did you have in mind? My lord? Uh, can you the help Crown's my family? I assume you have a proposition? No, not really. I don't give a shit. had a reason for coming here. I know it wasn't just to entertain me. Help me stop the White Hills. Well, the quickest way to strangle your enemy is with his own purse strings. Say the Crown agrees to buy Ironwood solely from you. Lord Whitehill will be left in the cold. If he wishes to sell to the Crown, he'll have to do so through your family. You will have him at your mercy. Or you'll bring your houses to open war. What? You do know that's a possibility, don't you? I'm not afraid. If war comes, I know we will win. You have no shortage of confidence. Can we uh, are the power of the North? I'll consider the arrangement. Of course, you'd have to do something for me in return. I'm not marrying you. Don't worry. The terms will be fair. What is it you want? You'll know soon enough. We have an understanding then. Thank you, my lord. Oh, he gonna make me like do some dirty this stuff. This will either be very good for both of us, or very bad for you. 
For your sake, I hope it's the former. Is that a threat? Did my Lord lady. Tyrion just threaten me? I thought he's supposed to be on everybody's side. I finally have control over a character uh, and it's not like in the middle of a cutscene I'm just gonna end this episode here because I want to try to keep the episode somewhat short because I know this game can get really long so uh, I'll leave it here and then we'll take it off from here in the next episode so thank you guys for watching I hope you enjoyed it I hope you are going back to the past with Game of Thrones with me because I definitely miss Game of Thrones. I'm probably, like I said, the only one that does, but whatever. So uh, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and let me know in the comments if I'm making bad decisions. So uh, bye!